Hey everyone, Ben back from Living Survival and today we're going to take a look at a few products from a company called Grim Workshop. We're going to take a look at their EDC knife and scout sheath and we're also going to take a look at some of their new products including something that they launched on Kickstarter. It's already funded almost up to $30,000. They only went for $2,000 so pretty popular product and pretty useful product. We'll take a look at that right now. <laughs> So first of all, Grim Workshop makes a ton of these little survival cards. This is their bushcraft card. You can see it has a little knife in here, uh, a little uh, spear point here, and uh, a few little hooks. They make a bunch of different cards with a bunch of different applications. You can check their website out for a bunch of different configurations of these. They're credit card sized, so you can slip them right in your wallet, uh, slip them right in you know, uh, a kit, they take up no room, and you never know, something like this could be pretty useful. I've used the hooks from survival cards before, and uh, there's a bunch of other YouTube videos on there showing these uh, in use. So check out their website, you can see all their different uh, cards. They also have micro cards, which are real uh, uh, thin, you know, like handcuff key on one of them. D tons of different applications. They also make weatherproof, um, uh, like tip cards or learning cards with different information on them, knots and, and different information like that. So weatherproof uh, cards that you can keep in your wallet, those are pretty cool. And then they also make these in a dog tag form as well. I forgot to bring one out with me to show you, but a dog tag, you can wear it around your neck. It's got a couple survival hooks on it. Uh, so these are just their little survival type cards. The next thing I wanted to show you, which I thought was really cool that I found on their website, is this EDC knife and scout carry sheath. It's $39, which I think is a pretty good deal considering you get a nice leather sheath uh, with it. It is, you know, multi-purpose. You can carry this different ways. You could hook some uh, cordage through here and carry it as a neck knife. You could carry it as a boot knife. Of course, you can carry it as a belt knife. Slip this into a uh, pocket or a pack. Uh, the strap comes off on it so you can quickly you know lash it to a pack loop or you could put a carabiner on it or as I mentioned you could just wear it scout wear it scout carry on your uh, your belt loop they also make the their little uh, EDC knife this is a little d2 uh, steel knife pretty sharp I'll probably touch it up a little bit but you do have multiple you know hand grip options with this little knife nice to have a little knife like this especially if you're gonna use it how I use it and use it in it in it uh, you know in conjunction with a little survival kit or a little fire kit nice to have a little knife that you could shave down tinder with um, maybe something that you know you could put in a little uh, cooking kit that you could use to you know chop up vegetables or something like that tons of different uses for a little knife like this so I thought that was really uh, really pretty cool and a nice bargain at 39 bucks for a nice little d2 knife and uh, and sheath finally what really caught my eye from Grim Workshop are these bandit bands these are on Kickstarter I believe they have about 17 days left on these they're fully backed they got fully backed probably the first day they're up to like thirty thousand dollars out of a two thousand uh, dollar Kickstarter campaign these are really cool because they're so multi-purpose they're just little elastic bands and they're so useful I find just tons of different ways you can use these there's um, two pockets on one side and uh, three pockets on the other side, as well as the main pocket. So you could use it as a wallet, as I have configured here. I've got a little right in the rain uh, polka pen here and, an, and a through night flashlight. You know, something that's super compact and portable that you can carry as a wallet, but then you can also have a little EDC flashlight with you, a little pen. I even have a little uh, polka uh, micro notes pad in the back here. So, you know, you have a little, uh, you know, thing to take notes on. Um, so these are really, really useful. They just pop off. Again, they're just like a little elastic. And then again, you can stick these on just about anything. The second one I have set up here is a little fire kit. So a little Altoids tin full of tinder. I just have it wrapped around. So not only is it multi-purpose in that it keeps my Altoids tin shut, but I can also carry things on it like this Exotech uh, fire rod and Exotech uh, nano spark. And then again, as I mentioned, it keeps my Altoids tin from coming open so you just slip that off and then I have a ton of tinder in here so just grab some of that tinder throw a spark to it and you've got a nice fire or a nice easy way 
to get a uh, fire going. And then you just slip your little elastic band around here and stick your tools back in. Even if you have a knife, let's say you have a knife sheath that didn't come with like a ferro rod loop or something, you know, you can slip these right on to a, uh, a knife sheath and then it's an easy way to carry a ferro rod or anything else that you might want to put on a knife. You could throw the little striker on there, you could throw a flashlight on here. So sky's really the limit when it comes to these bands. They're super useful, uh, super handy. So super quick video today guys, I just thought I'd show you some of the capabilities of their Bandit Bands. If you want one, a Kickstarter link will be below. If you want any of their other products, make sure to check out their website. You can check out all the different survival type cards that they have. And of course their little EDC knife, which I thought was pretty dang cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and give it a big thumbs up for me. Make sure you leave me that comment in the comment section below and share this video to any friends or family on your social media. If you haven't already done so, please consider clicking that red subscribe button and that notification bell to be notified of new videos.